land, earth, ground, soil, territory. What is my relationship to the land? In the year 2020, when we were all on the verge of a pandemic, I bought an acre of land in rural Ohio because I needed to know what it felt like to be close to the earth. I needed to have a sense of belonging to the land. Even if this piece of earth is really a proxy, a stand-in for another piece of earth far away, I still wanted that closeness to it. My ancestral homeland is Palestine, and I have never been there, and I may never get the chance to be there. Sometimes I long for that place that I've never been. What does it feel like to have that bond with the land, to know a place intimately as your own throughout time? Your parents, your grandparents, and generations of your family were born there and lived there and loved there and wept there. Right now I'm standing on the soil north of the Ohio River on what the indigenous people call Turtle Island. In ancient times, this land belonged to the mound builders, the Adena and Hopewell cultures. And after them, this land belonged to their descendants, the Shawnee, the Delaware, and the Miami peoples. This was their land until European settlers took it from them and forcibly removed them from it. In the same way, European settlers forced my people from their land in Palestine and took it from them. And that's when my family ended up here in Ohio on someone else's stolen land. All of this to say, my relationship with the land is complicated and yet I long to be close to it. <laughs>